Sirius XM is in the headlines. You know, the satellite radio giant, and yes, the place Howard Stern made famous. No argument there. Sirius XM announced that it has acquired internet radio giant Pandora in a $3.5 billion all-stock deal that will bring both companies together into one massive audio entertainment firm. Now, in a press release from earlier today, both companies said that their brands, products, and services will continue to operate under a definitive agreement which creates one company with more than $7 billion in expected pro forma revenue in 2018 and strong long-term growth opportunities. Sirius XM, whose expertise is in subscription radios in cars, will benefit from Pandora's home and mobile-based music service. Now, Sirius XM has about 36 million North American subscribers. I'm one of them because of Howard. While Pandora has around 70 million monthly active users. However, it's the latter, Pandora, that's, had, that's been in an odd financial spot for the last few years as it found its traditional ad-supported radio service feeling the heat from competitors such as Spotify and Apple Music. Now, hopefully the acquisition will work out for both companies. And in the end, there's only one real question here. First, there was Sirius. It beat and acquired XM, became Sirius XM. Now that it has Pandora, What's the new company's going? What's the new company's name going to be? My guess is something along the lines of Sirius XM Dora. Can't think of anything better than that. For Modern Wall Street, I'm James Sweeney.